Tonight's Whiz Quiz Contests are brought to you by Rhodes State College, committed to your success. RhodesState.edu and by Hupy Hamburgers, the taste of Lima since 1928. All right, we're glad that you're back, everyone. We just wrapped up a great game between Delphus and New Bremen. The score there, Delphus St. John's was 70 points, New Bremen with 95. So that means New Bremen will be moving on, eventually taking on the winner of this game between Botkins and Finley. Let's introduce you to our players joining us from Botkins. We have Bella Yuri, Olivia Yuri, Micah Smock, and Damian Metz. And Botkins is coached by Ryan Loy. Welcome to all of you. Turning now to Finley High School. Jamie Tesnow, Kayla Keckler, Brian Yo, and Austin Keppers. And Finley is coached by David Barkey. Welcome to all of you as well. All right, our first round, 10 questions were 10 points apiece. Everybody knows to get that buzzer ready. Please speak up and speak loudly and clearly. And when you're giving a name, make sure you're as complete as possible with your answer, okay? All right, here we go. Question number one. What musical word is derived from the Latin word for ladder? Yes, Finley. Scale. Scale is correct. What gland secretes a digestive juice into the small intestine? Yes, that would be Botkins. Pancreas. Pancreas is the answer. Who was the first African American to win a Grand Slam tournament? All right, our buzzer sounded before yours, so we'll have to uh, give you the answer here. It's Arthur Ashe. Okay, number four, what word means to redistribute congressional seats based on population changes? The answer is reapportionment. Give the name of a wave motion measured in decibels. Botkins. Sound. Sound is the answer. A painting directly on a wall is called what? Bodkins. Mural. Mural is correct. Name the porous volcanic rock that people can use to scrub their skin. Finley. Pumice. Pumice is correct. What word designates a false name as a pen name? Bodkins. Pseudonym. Pseudonym is correct. You have two questions remaining in your first round. Identify the word ending in O that is a master of an art. Finley. Maestro. Maestro is correct. And your final question, give the prime factorization of the number 28. Um, seven times two times two. That is correct. All right, we've come to the end of round one between Finley and Bodkins, and we have a tie. So we had a to coin toss earlier, and um, we have Finley, who will be going first in this round. You have five questions with five points apiece. They are all yours, but please buzz in with your answer. Name the independent country that lies entirely within the capital of another country. Yes. Vatican City. You are correct, Vatican City. What color is most often associated with anger? Yes. Red. Red is correct. Who was the oldest signer of the Constitution? Yes. Benjamin Franklin. That is correct. Name the chemical process where a metal is broken down by oxygen, acid, alkali, or water. Yes. Oxidation. That is correct, oxidation. And your final question in this round. Who spent time with the Yahoos in a 1726 novel? <laughs> the 
The answer is Gulliver. All right, turning over to Botkins now. Your five questions, everybody set here? Yep. All right, what M verb means to unite and become one? Yes. Merge. Merge is the answer. Which occupation is designated by the abbreviation RN? Yes. Registered nurse. That is correct. What was the central issue in the proposed 27th Amendment? It is the Equal Rights Amendment or Equal Rights for Women. Name the ethnic group of dwarves found in Africa. Yes. Pygmies. Pygmies is the answer. And here's your final question. Identify the tough, elastic, whitish substance forming part of a skeleton. Yes. Ligament. Ligament is incorrect. Cartilage is the answer. All right, we've come to the end of rounds one and two, and it is a close game. Finley, you have 60 points. Botkins with 55. We'll be back with our final 10 questions after the break. Don't go away.